Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Fable 2. All right, when we left off, uh, it became daylight really quickly in this town. And uh, I keep getting propositioned by prostitutes. Anywho, um, when we left off, I was trying to help uh, Toby, of uh, the religion Toby, to then get the Mutton of Truth, which has apparently been stolen from him. And I guess we're going to have to steal it back. Because that's a thing that they need me to do, I guess. And I feel like an asshole that I have to do this. But there's no real choice that I have. Yep, there it is. The Mutton of Eternal Hope. And I'm annoyed that the first thing I went to was not the right one. Grr. Anyway. Now that I've done that. I'll have to ask you to leave. I understand. I left. I left. I understand I you completely on that one. Yay! Sir, I understand. Thanks. And I have a lot of purifying Thanks. to catch up with. Thank you. To uh, make up for the fact that I did all that shit. Is that a... Okay. I was about to say. Is that bugged now or not? Okay. Good to have you back. Well, he didn't notice me doing it, which is good. All right, I want kind of want to see Cult of Blades. Oh, it's evil. <laughs> Damn it! Why does all the cool sounding ones have to be evil? Years after the death of Jack of Blades, a cult who worshipped him and attempted to find ways to bring him back made a brief appearance. Yeah, of course it did. That sounds like exactly a thing people would do. Uh, their members all sported these tattoos and set out to spread violence and chaos wherever they went. Well, I mean, considering it was Jack of Blades, yeah, I, mean, I understand that. Okay. Okay. I'll be a knight. Okay. That's... Oh, it adds attractiveness. These intricate patterns are based on the now long-lost tapestries of the first societies to emerge after the fall of the Old Kingdom. It was a time of uncertainty, superstition, and fear. And these designs were meant to ward off evil. Let's see what they look like. Ooh. That actually looks kind of cool. Those are the designs anyway, yeah. It's for the face. It's for the body. I do kind of look... I like that look. Thessians, huh? It's similar sort of attractiveness. That. The ancient Thessians had a deep love for labyrinths. Uh-huh. Which went so far that even their streets were giant puzzles to be solved during everyday use. No. No. I would not want that. No. This obsession is reflected in their body art, which is meant to represent the enigma of the human soul that dwells beneath the skin. How about no? <laughs> How about that? Mm? Okay. And scariness for the Death Clan, which makes sense considering it's named the Death Clan. The Death Clan was a notorious gang of bandits who terrorized Albion over 200 years ago. Members of the clan all wore these hideous tattoos, designed to inspire fear to the point where many people believe the bandits weren't human at all. Human at all. I can't fucking talk. But monstrous spirits sent to torment humanity. Oh boy. Yep, that is a look. Thessians one actually looks kind of cool too. As done the as done as does the Albionite. I can't fucking talk anymore, man. <laughs> Jesus, I kind of want to get a body tattoo. Honestly, I really want to. So I think. No, nah, I'm not gonna go for Thessians. <laughs> I'm gonna go for Albionite. That item. makes sense. Even though I don't really show off tattoos on this body at all. So anything else in here? Did is there anything else going on here? Ah, that's stealing because I can't buy the fucking place yet. I can't buy up the property. That sucks. I want to buy it up though. And, okay. Well, I've got the mutton. At this point, I was just putzing around trying to make make up You're for the fact that I had to steal this guy's door. shit. Uh, porcelain doll. There it is. 
sell that because eh, porcelain dolls are creepy. I'm sorry, they are. <laughs> Yeah. They just are. Okay, I don't Pleasure care if you serve. like them. That's your prerogative. Just keep it away from me. Okay. Let's just bring this back. To make up for the fact that we just stole shit for this asshole who says that it was stolen from him. So, we'll find out. Hey there, Toby. Here's your Wonderful. Thing. You have retrieved the mutton of eternal hope. Yes, I have. You are a deserving member of T.O.B.Y. Right. It is time I told you the reason for this city's chaotic state. Yes, please do. Forget about Reva. Bloodstone is ruled by a secret organization known as the Silver Serpent. The Silver Serpent, you say? I will tell you more soon. But first, you must recover the second of the stolen holy ritual pieces. Okay. It is the wine of forgiveness. The wine of forgiveness. I sense it is hidden in a nearby house. I see two barrels and a cart outside. Turn left mm. when you leave and go up the street. Left and then up the street. I, I don't know why he gave me directions when I have a fucking little guided path to tell me where to go. But. I guess once we get there, we'll find out. Can I? Prices have been lower than this in the past, but hey, at least now we've got the gold in our pocket to buy the stuff. Oh, someone's trying to sleep. Okay. Well, I guess we can't go in there until it's daytime. Again. Yay. Okay, well then. In that case... So... This is the biggest house in the area, so I'm going to assume that's Reavers. But we won't get to that just yet. What I want to do, we'll finish the cellar. Can I talk to you? There we Always go. A pleasure to Hit the button like five times and didn't want to do it. Lullaby children's bed. Is there anything... I was about to say anything stronger. <laughs> anything more luxurious when it comes to children's beds? No, does not look like it. Balls. Well, I tried. I tried and failed. Um, I'm trying to look for other things to dress up the house back in Bowerstone, but I don't think there's... Yeah, there's not much that I can do. Ah, well. Um, I can't use that. Okay, I'm trying to figure out a way to pass the time without having to lose my regen ability. And I bought up the rest of the buildings as well. So, there's not much else I can do <laughs> to pass the time now that it is nearly bedtime for some people as well. Oh, man. Man. I had to fucking... Had to go to fucking bedtime. It just had to, didn't it? Um. <laughs> I do not want the time of my life. With you because I'm married. Damn it. Ooh. Hey, it's open now. Cool beans. Um. Fuck, where's. Damn it. Come on, where is it? Where would it be? Damn it, you. Fuck, you're making me steal thing after thing. I'm going to have to do some serious repentance after this. Oh, come on. Where the fuck is it? Oh, fucking finally. Okay. Give Toby the wine. Can I give him a foot in the ass as well? For making me do this shit? Ugh. This is not pleasant. Why do I have to keep telling you people no, I don't? Ah. Might as well sell off the ill-gotten gains at this point. Uh -huh. Don't want any of this. You ever rolled in the hay with the pro? Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> ever rolled in the hay with the pro? <laughs> we have some new things in stock you might like. <laughs> That's a new one, okay? That's a new one. That's absolutely a new one that I absolutely love <laughs> okay 
Um, I've kept so many fucking dies, it's not even funny. Um, sell all these. Oh, Someone I had three of those. Do you have any other items I might be interested in? Um, we'll find out in a second, won't we? Um, Highwayman hat. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. Always happy to Double buy gents your unwanted trousers. items. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't need this. Someone will be able to use that. Yeah, I'm sure someone. Maybe not anyone here, but someone. All right. Yeah, we'll call that good. That's just fine. Jeez. Just, I keep getting propositioned by prostitutes. Uh, I'm married. I'm married. Can't I just, like, hold a sign around my neck saying I'm married? Please stop. Oh, look at you. You're further down here now. How about that? Here's your wine you made me steal. Excellent. Soon I will be able to perform the ritual and destroy the Silver Serpent Gang. Uh -huh. That's paving the way for our benevolent Yokel Crusade. The ritual will destroy like the, the gang. the other holy pieces, the next item appears to be a mundane object, yet has remarkable power. Uh -huh. It is the Sacred Pie of Kindness. The Sacred Pie of Kindness. I sense it is being kept in a house next to the boathouse. Just let your nose guide you. Right. We're gonna go through all of this and find out this was just letting him get food that he wanted Would to steal like from other people, but he's too fat and stupid to do it himself. Ready for a good time. Huh. Well, I wouldn't I wouldn't say stupid, he's able to manipulate me into Yay! doing a thing. But Oh hey. Something about the worst marksman of all time. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> well, I heard that, so I'm going to assume. Ah, it's not there. Where is he at? There should we go somewhere? He's nearby. Oh. Uh, there he is. Been working like a dog myself lately. Okay, well, here once again. Am I doing this shit? You How about a nice time? Oh boy. Oh, thank God I found it immediately. Oh, I was going to be so mad if I had to fucking run around to look for it again. Okay, here's hoping I can... No, I can't really hit him from this spot, can I? Oh, for fuck's sake. I can hit a castle. I can hit you. Watch. Fuck you. Told you. Well, I'm, I'm doing things that are necessary of me. I'm a hero? You, you don't need to know. Okay. Speaking of things that are necessary because I'm a hero, I'm giving this fuck the pie of kindness. Good gods. Ah, yes. Thank you. A million times, thank you. We will clean up this city after all. Right. In fact, before we gather the final items for the ritual of cleansing, I have an important mission for you. Right. One that will begin the purge at once. Will it? It has come to my attention that certain poor people are forced to walk the streets, selling their flesh in the most sinful way. Bring me one such lost soul that I may show her the error of her ways. Her. Bring a prostitute to Toby. It's closing time for all shops. I'm starting to think I was guessing right. <laughs> that this fuck is making me grab a whole bunch of shit for him. And he's just naming it ways to make it seem like it's good for him and his organization of benevolent yokeling or yodeling or something. Whatever the fuck it is. I'm starting to think it's a sham. Ain't fair, is it? Here you are. I don't even own my own pants. Well, that's oh, it's not you. necessarily my fault. Oh! <laughs> Thank you for the Please, discount. This little gift. Thank you for well, the discount. You nice You're very nice. Thank you. I um, I want to turn the script of this on its head. Looking for some quick fun. 
Um, is it just going to point me to one? <laughs> Damn it. Not going to let me. Is it not going to let me at all? Um. Whoa! I can't wait to see what happens. Let's do a thumbs up. Sure thing. Anything you want. Okay. Oh. Shame I can't afford to burn my own place. Still, at least the rent isn't too bad. Yeah, I was about to say. I thought I said the rent for a pretty you decent amount. Are you feeling lonely? So I'll bring this guy with me, and I'll wonder if this changes the script at all. I mean, I brought you a prostitute. <laughs> I did the thing. The ring, you know. The kind that means you're getting married. Well, there's that. Yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> oh, this better be you're not going to teach him anything? Okay. What the hub? To think I liked you. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let's see. Uh, okay, that was kind of rude of me, I'll admit. All right, then. All right, let's follow the script since the game won't let me do anything else. All right. Um, Would you like a private party? Yeah, sure. Why not? Follow me. Let's you go. You absolutely fabulous. Right. You gonna follow me or? No. Okay. Bev, come on, we need to go here. What's it like being so rich? It's pretty nice. And Always ready to follow. Until it's this sort of crazy shit that I end up doing for fucking putzes like this guy. Oh, yes. Very good. Very good. This poor woman needs my full attention. Right. Now, if you'll just leave us alone, I'll call you when you're needed again. I'm sorry. I have to leave you alone? Why can't I view the ritual? Hmm? Because the ritual is less a ritual and more of the horizontal tango? Hmm? A little of the wink wink nudge nudge cinema cinema? Hmm? Hmm? Right. This is when we're gonna find out that he's a fucking putz, isn't it? Oh, and the door's shut, too. You're one pretty sight, all right. Oh, well, thank you. Nice to know I'm a pretty sight. Also, try to find out more about around. Toby. How about that? So, you're Toby's latest patsy, are ya? Yeah, I guess so. That swine always gets an outsider to do his dirty business using some scam. Oh, really? What was it this time? The temple thing again? Yeah. <laughs> Huh. I bet he reeled you in by talking to some fake brother or sister about how to clean up this town. Uh, you ask okay. me. You ought to get rid of that swindler. Scare That's him out of true. town or cut his head off. I don't care. Plenty of people around here will thank you for it. And you've got no guards to worry about. That's Good. true. Huh. I might... I might just off him. He's made me ruin my purity at this point. Might as well go for broke. What? Go away! I'm busy! I don't care. Fucking get to the door. I won't ask you again. Get lost! Look, I said... Oh, it's you. Yeah. Uh, I'm not quite finished here. Why don't you go and find... Um, uh, let me see. What else do I want? What else do you want? Huh? What else do you want? That's fine. That's just fine. You are now famous enough to use the kiss my ass expression. <laughs> chair squeaked because I fucking leaned sideways away from the microphone. <laughs> I'm now famous enough to tell you to kiss my ass. Oh, that's great. 
Uh, Toby won't be conning anyone else with his fake faith swindles anymore, and it's all thanks to you, because I killed him dead. <laughs> Quite frankly, like I said, my purity was already broken at this point because of him. Why not go for broke, ruin it more, by just offing him and never making it happen again to anyone else? Because this guy... This guy is a fucking asshole. I, I had a feeling it was some sort of fake bullshit from the moment it started. And not just because this is the fourth time I've done this quest. <laughs> uh, with sunshine. With sunshine. The, the fact that I killed Toby... Is lying Pat's Ooh. ass. All right. Welcome to our part of the world. Ooh, hey. Famed adventurer. I can buy the building now the because he's dead. Certainly yeah, he the ladder effect. All right. Owners killed. Well, I technically killed one of the owners. A uh, previous owner, yeah. The Temple of Benevolent Yokels. Everybody in Bloodstone knows about Toby, though it has only been recently established. Yeah, because he's a scumbag fuck who I killed because he is a scumbag fuck. Let's rent it out, shall we? That's what I think of your property, fucking Toby, you asshole. Alright. Hey, it's bedtime. And it's officially time for me to see if I can buy any more buildings now that I fucking did that thing. I doubt I can. Wait. Wait. <laughs> yes, I can. How about that? Alright, the Death Factory. What? Sailors who did not perform well during an outing were not thrown into the sea to drown. They were brought to this house, where a man who claimed to be a doctor would treat them until they begged for death. Okay. How do you get the do-gooder bonus from that? How is that a thing? That's what I want to know. Okay, then. That's a thing. That's a goofy thing. Alright, maybe I can buy that tattoo shop now. Oh! Oh, boy! What the fuck? This is new! What the fuck? Please stand by while we assassinate you. Well, uh, let's not say we did, huh? Come on. Come on. Die already. Come on, damn it. There we go. There we go. Whoo! Did not think that would happen in town. That's a new one. Alright, the second sketch fragment. Alright. Putting the two fragments together and then squinting shows the image of a large crab. Well, all right, I can now raise dead. Put that away. There we go. Amazing. There we go. I did a good thing, guys. Did a good thing. Whoa. <laughs> I went in there to fix the spell selector because I just realized everything is broken. Um, uh, where's the dead? There it is. Um, this was not... That was it. That was supposed to be there. And um, this is supposed to be on... Eh, let's put it on fireball. So, it's supposed to be a force push. Uh... Raise dead, then time. Yeah, and then that and that. Okay, yeah, that'll work. That'll work just fine. Okay. <laughs> now that I fixed that, because that apparently broke at some point. All right. Um, wow. What the? They're not happy with me. Oh, that's why they're not happy with me. Let's do a little bit of dancing, huh? Let's, uh, let's get Anna to like us, shall we? I think we shall. 
Hey! Hey! Oh, boy. I made them very much like me. That's something. What do they like? <laughs> they like the expression pickup line. Alrighty. Um, let's not do that, shall we? Just the thing to get rid of the red mist. Yeah, the red mist. <laughs> the red mist, she says. Alright. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna end the episode here for right now, because at this point, all I'm doing is <laughs> trying to entertain the locals. So, I'm just gonna end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. I can't fucking talk. <laughs> I almost screwed up my outro again. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and entertaining the yokels after I killed the benevolent yokeling person, Toby who's actually a gigantic scumbag for you. <laughs>